Hello everybody and welcome back again to another episode of Mass Effect 3 in which we are going to start our first DLC. And like I said before, I have been getting a lot of recommendations when to do which DLC and as usual, you know, different people have different preferences so whenever I'm going to do it some people will think it's too early or too late or whatever uh, so I just have to kind of split the difference here. Plus, um, my personal preferences when it comes to DLC is, first of all, I kind of want to do them, you know, from start to finish and not, you know, break them up into different parts. And secondly, I don't really want to do all the DLC in a row. Unless I can actually do them, you know, after the game, you know, kind of like I did in Dragon Age Inquisition, where I played the main game first and then all the DLC. But um, I've been told I have to do the DLC um, before the end of the game and I don't want to slow down the main story too much by doing like three DLC in in a row. So we're going to do the first DLC now and after that we're going to, you know, continue with our main story. Anyway, um, I have to go to the Citadel for that. I'm actually still in the vicinity. So yeah, let's let's get this started. Um, right, this is the one for Arya, and I'm I think I'm supposed to meet her Doc Forty Two. So let's do this. Are you brave? Uh, the great Commander Shepard, <laughs> and me without my autograph <laughs> book. Save it. Just take me to Aria. I can sign Follow your chest me. plate, if you like. <laughs> so where is she? Shepard. <laughs> Aria. How dramatic. There are too many eyes and ears in purgatory. I assume this is about retaking Omega. This is about your war, Shepard. <laughs> Cerberus controlling the Terminus system seriously bolsters their mobility. Since taking Omega, they've spread through the galaxy. Surely the Alliance has noticed. Cut to the chase. What's your plan? Kick them out. I've amassed a fleet of Merc ships. We're going to punch through enemy lines and invade. Once we're on Omega, it's a ground war. That's why I want you. I <laughs> only accept the best. The leader of the Cerberus occupation is General Oleg Petrovsky. He's the one who ousted me. Don't know him. The elusive man's top military strategist and <laughs> best kept secret. But all you really need to know is that he's a merciless bastard. So what exactly do you expect here? What's your mm -hmm. intel on the occupation? Petrovsky's army is massive and he's got Omega locked tight. The information stops there. So you're winging it. <laughs> Not at all. There are secrets on Omega only I know. Secrets that will provide us a foothold. I can tell you this. Petrovsky's invasion was precise and ruthless. He'll stop at nothing to win. <laughs> yes, yeah, some might say the same about you. Sounds familiar. Shepard, I know my reputation. I know I'm hated. I ruled Omega with an iron fist. But the people were free. Their lives were theirs. I preserved that. This man took all that away and he <laughs> is going to pay. When Omega is mine again, I'll give you everything. I've got ships, mercs, Ezo, all yours for the war. What's the catch? I have objections to some of the company you keep. <laughs> so you'll have to leave the Normandy and its crew behind. My crew are professionals. Let's just say I want you all to myself. <laughs> All right, so who, who do you object to from my crew? Bray will provide coordinates to my fleet. Oh, and 
while we're still in the Citadel. Please be discreet. I'm always discreet. I only occasionally blow up things. The fleet is hidden in this system. Signal me when you're on your way. Ari and I will meet you on the command ship. <laughs> Can't wait to see what all the fuss is about. Okay. So, um, well, and it dropped me back on the Normandy. Um... Okay, I have to go and rendezvous with the fleet. Yeah, let's do that. Arya's fleet, an assortment of vessels, warships, transports and fighters flying under Arya's flag. Alright. Um... I think I'm still doing fine and... Ooh, look at that. I actually have Arya in my party. Huh, okay, okay. Um, I'm going to give you one of the guns that's actually upgraded. And I think the Hurricane should work out for you. And let me modify it. Mm, don't need weight, don't need magazine. I'll take the increased damage. I don't really need more capacity. I don't need the scope. Um. I should get some better mods for the submachine guns. Well, I guess uh, in that case you get the more power damage because, I mean, what kind of powers does Arya have anyway? But I guess we can use this for now. Alright, um, that's fine. And let me give you a better shotgun as well. And we have this bastard over here. <laughs> but it needs to be charged, which, which probably means that my companions won't be using it correctly. Um, hmm. How about the claymore? Um, yeah, sure. I think you can use this one. Lots and lots of damage. <laughs> and this isn't too bad. I'm not sure if you really want to do melee fighting. And yeah, I suppose we can add a little bit more damage. Alright, alright, here we go. Um, no, I, I'm done. Let's move out. And, oh yeah, I have to level her up. Well, apparently she is a biotic. Biotic boss, actually. Alright, um... Let's give you some skills. Health and shields, power damage. Yeah, I'm going for the power damage. And even more power damage. <laughs> Increase the entire squad's health and shield bonus by 20%. Increase health and shield bonus by 40%. Well, I picked uh, power damage twice, and maybe we can give her more health now. Um, well, Reef is nice. Um, I want to do that. Um, more impact radius. More recharge speed. And sure, armor and barriers. She has carnage. <laughs> flare. Focus and expand all biotic energy to unleash a huge flare that throws enemies within its range, causing massive damage. Oh, I may want to have this. This sounds nice. Um, increased damage and force by 30%. Increase recharge speed. Yes. Increase damage done to shields and barriers by 75%. Yes. And I guess you can have some uh, basic levels into this as well. I mean, I have Carnage, so... Oh, I 
totally undid it all. I didn't want to do that. That sucks. Okay, <laughs> let's do it all over again. Well, I, I know what I want to do, so this should be quick. Pa uh, I did it again. Wrong. All right. I am so stupid. Uh, power damage. Power damage. Um, and health and shield. Uh, recharge speed. Damage and force. Recharge speed. And more damage to shields. Um, yeah, let's use the impact radius. Recharge speed. And this one again. And give you some basic skills into this. And, well, I guess one point into Carnage so that you at least have it. Alright, um, I think I'm, I'm good to go. We're outshipped four to one. And most of our vessels are transports with limited firepower. We're not here to win a space battle, Jarl. We just have to punch through their line. So, you commandeered a Cerberus cruiser. The guest of honor has arrived. <laughs> we can finally start. Let me guess. You're planning on infiltrating the enemy fleet. Exactly. We position ourselves to strike a crippling blow, then my forces join the fun. I like it. Works for me. If you're as accommodating the rest of the way, <laughs> we'll get along very well. Then let's quit talking and get to it. Bray, move through the relay. Signal the fleet to wait. They only follow on my command. Reckless plants are right up my alley. <laughs> Head for the command ship. <laughs> Cruiser, I don't have you on a flight plan. Identify yourself. This is Captain Lance. Run voice recognition. Alpha Tango Z. We took damage. Seeking repairs. Identity confirmed, Captain. Pulled for approach authorization. How did you get the captain to say that? The hard way. Mm. That's right. Nice and slow. Be patient. Get as close as you can. Fire! Signal the fleet through the relay. <laughs> All right, let's do this. We're through. Head straight for the station. We're being hailed by the general. Should be interesting. Put him through. Aria, I knew this had to be you. You'll never make it. Call it off now. You're barking up the wrong tree, general. But maybe you can convince my partner. Commander Shepard, I've heard great things about you. <laughs> I, I've only seen this guy for like a minute and I already know that he's like your stereotypical villain. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not sure if the elusive man had good things to say about me. I doubt the elusive man thinks of me that highly. Yeah. I do my own research, Commander. <laughs> a pity you left, Cerberus. We all sabotage ourselves in nefarious ways. Perhaps deep down you fear <laughs> success. And Arya clearly thinks seeing you will unsettle me. Now it's my turn. I see you've gone to the trouble of augmenting that ship with Solaris armoring. An exorbitant waste. <laughs> I've made improvements to Omega's outer defenses. My cannons will cut through you at will. Sounds pretty confident. Yeah, he does. So again, I say turn back. Hmm. Let's see what you've got, Oleg. <laughs> End transmission. Are you calling him a bluff? That went well. Set preset course. We're ramming the station. Everyone <laughs> brace for impact. What? 
Omega's kinetic barrier will stop my ships from landing. I equipped this cruiser with disruptors to take it out on impact. Don't worry. We'll probably survive the Ooh. crash. Okay. Shields gone! All systems failing! We can make it! Arya, don't be stupid. Sound the evac. Damn it. Program escape pods for the station. Let's go. Everyone out. There's no time. <laughs> you too. Well? I have experience with fleeing exploding ships. Although last time I died while doing Guess that, that so. asshole really did upgrade <laughs> Omega's outer defenses. So it would seem. Quite an entrance. <laughs> and more Cerberus punching. <laughs> Hope the other escape pods made it. All right, what's our target? Need to hit the defense system station. Shut down Omega's outer defenses so my ships can land. If we don't, they'll be blown to bits like we were. Got it. All right. <laughs> this is what I brought you for. Ground assault. In combat, what you say goes. Well... I'm glad to hear that. Makes sense. We play to our strengths. I know where we need to go, and you can get us there. Okay, let's move. All right, uh, hang on a second. I need to uh, get my scale burn order. So, it's only me and area. Hmm. I do want to use your reef. And I like the description of flare, so let's get this one as well um, and well I suppose we can use the lash as well and I'm going to take back my concussive shot so yep here we go also I should probably take some ammo power um, let's go for the disruptor ammo because Cerberus people Often have shields. All right, um, let's do this area. Let me try your. Ooh, well, that was impressive. All right, we have a shield guy over here. Ah. Where is that grenade? Well, that's probably a bit too close. Well. Work out well enough. All right. Um, we still have more Cerberus people, though. All right. Let's try some of Arya's biotic skills. There we go. Um. Oh, uh, get away from me. There we go. And someone over here. All right. Um, yeah, let me just punch you. Um, there is one more person alive. Right here. And there we go. Aria, where are you? Our pod took out the main exit. Oh, Use the here. controls to lower the blast door. Okay, um, let me have a look around though. Over here, Shepard. Yes, yes, give me some time. I don't want to miss stuff. 
Huh. All right. Um, hang on a second. Let me heal up and then I will take this. <coughs> and there's another one over here. Well. Okay, um, let's have a quick save and blast to the door controls. Aria to fleet. You alive out there? Barely. Holding our own with the Cerberus fleet, but Omega's defenses are shredding us. Keep my army intact, Gerald. That is your only job. <laughs> Um, yes, of course, we have we have more of these guys. And I see some shield guys. Maybe I Help. actually want to... Your boss, I'm coming for him. Oh, and you threw that right at my face. Okay, let me take some cover here and... Deal with the shield guys over here. Well, that works too. <laughs> and now this one. There we go. And some people over here. <laughs> nice. Very nice area. Alright. Where have oh, finally this this store over here. Oh. Let me pick up the stuff. And make sure to check this place, alright. Nothing of interest here. Anyway, let's use the door. Hm. Elevator. Ground team, report in. Bray, you there? Affirmative. But only six pods made it. Various entry points. Rally them to you, then head for the rendezvous hangar. Start prepping for our ships to land. All right. Okay, this is where I have to go. So let's hustle. Look around a little bit. Every minute, more of my ships get obliterated out there. <clears throat> yes, yes, I know. You're in a hurry. Um. General notice, power fluctuations continuing. To stabilize, sector 3, 40 and 15 are set for mandatory shutdown. All personnel to be reassigned. Hm. Alright. Oh, I already see some people, um, some engineers over there. Okay. Maybe you can take care of that guy. Thank you. And you are trying to set up a damn turret. And I think you actually succeeded. Well, let me throw a grenade at it. Alright, and now take down this sucker. There we go. Alright, very nice. Getting close. Those cannons have to be stopped. Let me pick up some new clips. Um, right, defense system is over there. Just, just making sure this way. that I'm not missing any stuff. Well, for just more clips, I guess. All right, um, let's do this. And I leveled up. Well, let me have a look. Can I actually do something with my points? Well, I have four points, but I think I would like to save them. And I guess I can increase your carnage. Why not? Alright, um... Let's see. The next area needs to be repressurized. Initiating! Alright. Stop well, we already have more sober soldiers coming. Oh, I see. Um, a nemesis. Oh yeah. Uh, Tell your boss I'm coming. Let for me him. deal with that 
lady first. And now these guys. Die. <laughs> Get away from the grenade. Alright. And I I see you over there. Let me come a little bit closer. Um you took it away from me. We have Centurion over here. Oh, I actually didn't want to do that. That was the wrong button. Um and got a guy over here. To get away from that. Repressurization complete. Access enabled. Alright, that's it. That's done it. Alright, let me refill my clips. There we go. So, um, we can use a door now, right? Let's do this. One of our pods. We were lucky. Press on. <laughs> Indeed. Lost two more transports. Can't keep up evasive maneuvers much longer. We're right outside the defense station. Hold tight. Okay, let's bypass the door. Um, I already see some enemies somewhere. And that's a generator. <laughs> Alright, I would like to come a little bit closer. Um, well... Let me grab that. And... We have an engineer over there. Let me destroy this first. Um, would you like a grenade, maybe? And Clear. there you go. Get to the controls. That flare is really, really powerful. Wow. Okay, um... Yeah, let me pick up more clips first. And look around this place a little bit. Um... Well, I'm not sure if I need to destroy the generators now. Hm. Okay, I don't see any more stuff, so let's use the controls over here. Jarl, defenses are down. Signal the surviving ships to converge on the rendezvous point. <laughs> All right. Done. Approach trajectories plotted. We're already queuing up. Bray, come in. Status. Rendezvous site secured. <coughs> Hangar doors enabled. We'll have them open soon. Need them open now. My birds are coming in. Prep for reception. What exactly is this rendezvous point? That's where we're headed. It's a bunker I established on D-Deck for my more sensitive operations. It's utterly impenetrable with its own secret hangar and dock. Independent power source, life support, munitions. You'll see. <laughs> Deploy to D-Deck. Investigate and await further instructions. <laughs> He's so playing is. chess. Really? <laughs> There's a good chance the general knows where we're going. Then no time for sightseeing. All right. All right. Apparently, Great. stay have sharp. To move on. You might get visitors. Terrific. Terrific indeed. All right. Um, isn't this the door that we came Take the from? Take far exit. I've locked down the way we came. Well, maybe it isn't. 
<laughs> no, it's it's not. What's going on there? Um Okay. And another elevator. Looks like other pod teams are causing trouble. <laughs> Good. Never never thought I'd see the day I'm fighting uh, alongside Watcher. Causing a stir. Hmm. Good. <laughs> Good indeed. All right. Um. Well, you need to back off. Feels good to let loose. <laughs> I see you're enjoying this. All right. Um. Hmm. Let me pick up more clips and. Yeah, I, I guess I just have to go through here. Okay. Oh, the Omega Skyline. <laughs> now I feel like I'm back. It's strange. What are those things in the distance? Some kind of force field. Ooh. That's not good. It's it's not really a skyline though if there's no sky, you know. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to pick this up. Non-humans currently without supervision are required to report to the nearest civilian containment area. <laughs> Why? What are they doing here? Okay, so, um, where do we go to next area? Uh, somewhere over there. Can't, can't climb over this, but I probably can Some climb over this. Oh, aha! Uh -huh. Well, stuff is going on over here. Um, lots of stuff indeed. Alright. Oh wait, um I see another shield guy. Let me try to take care of that guy. Well, not like that though. Whoa! Um did this guy just attack me from behind? Well let me let me get some cover and well, this sort of works as well, so We're getting close no need to for the, the sniper neighbor. rifle. Let's move. All right. Um, that's just a generator and a bunch of dead people. Huh. Okay. Um, where? Oh, I can I can go here. Right. I know that symbol. Looks like a gang tag. Oh. The Talons. They used to deface my property too. Hmm. Who are the Talons? Warning. Omega has been compromised. All servers personnel report to stations. The Talon symbol again. Could be evidence of a resistance. Might be useful. Okay, so it's some sort of gang. <coughs> Let me get some scrap metal. <laughs> How much <coughs> farther is this? One of my soldiers by the force field. <coughs> oh, okay. I need to drop down here? Yes.
What the hell is he doing? Um, probably dying. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> Max, take them out. Well, that is just brilliant. Okay, we have rampant Max apparently. Um All right. Oh, we need to get away from me though. There we go. Those mechs are coming through the force field. Well, they they are no, not like piece of shit. mechs are usually, no, because they move fast, like really fast. Let me um, change my ammo, maybe? They have armor, so... This could help. And... Oh, we have one over there. There we go. And, whoa, there, there's more of them. There's more of them. Bastards are fast! They are, they are. Um, and the next one. There we go. Need to check out that force field. Huh. All right. Let me grab some clips first. Over here, Shepard. Um. Poor yeah, but idiot. I think um. Something tells me these force fields are going to be a problem. Are we blocked? Not this time. Come here. What? <laughs> Hang on a second. This way. <clears throat> Door panel. Um, okay, but I think this is actually a good uh, time to make a cut here, so um, let's end the episode. And we're going to continue with the Omega DLC uh, tomorrow. So thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed, and see you again next time.